Hey, it's Sarah. In today's quick video, I'm going to go over the different course pricing options for Coursecraft. When you're pricing your course, you'll start on the pricing page here. It's under the edit section of your course and pricing in the left sidebar there. So you can see there are four different pricing options that you can add to your course. And I'll just go through them one at a time here. So the first one is a one-time payment. This is definitely the most common and most straightforward way to price your course. It's probably what you've seen almost everyone else do. Participants pay the set price and they get access to the course immediately. And just to show you, that's what this looks like on the landing page. So this is an enroll button and when you have a one-time payment set up, it'll say the price right on the button. The next pricing option is a payment plan. And this is a great option for higher priced courses that you'd like to break out into smaller payments. You choose the number of payments and the payment amount. Payments will happen on a monthly basis. And let's take a look at a landing page that has a payment plan set up. Right underneath the Enroll Now button, it'll show you how many payments of whatever a month. The next pricing option is called Pay What You Want. And this is a really fun way to price your course. You choose a suggested price and set a minimum payment, and people can choose whatever they wanna pay as long as it's above your minimum. Let's take a look at what that looks like on a landing page. The button says, as low as your minimum. When someone clicks on the enroll button, the payment field will be pre-populated with your suggested amount, but they can change the number to anything above your minimum payment. The last pricing option is free. And this is pretty self-explanatory. Your course is free. It doesn't cost any money to get into. And there are lots of great reasons to create a free course. For example, you could use it as a lead magnet or a gift for your followers. Now you don't have to choose only one pricing option for your course. You can combine the pricing options in whatever way you want. A really common way to combine them is with a one-time payment and a payment plan. So here I'll set up a one-time payment of $150 and then give my participants the option to pay three monthly payments of $50 instead. And this is what it looks like on the landing page if you have more than one pricing option set up. You can choose the pricing option that you want on the landing page and also make a last minute change during the checkout process if you want. I hope you liked this little tutorial and don't forget to subscribe to our channel to see our new videos every week. Bye.